Hi, this is Andy Trice back again, and today I want to show you the sound remover feature in Adobe Audition CC. And now, the sound remover is a really cool new feature. Uh, it's a process that allows you to extract certain elements out of your audio recording. So let's say if you have something in your audio that you don't want there, you can remove that from the final output. So for example, let's say if you have crickets in your recording and you want to remove the crickets, if you have a cell phone ringing in the background and you want to remove that without destroying uh, you know, your overall composition, without having just like pieces completely chopped out, you can remove those essentially specific frequencies. So let's go ahead and take a look. The first thing I want to show you is a recording of a guitar with a cell phone playing over top of it. Now that you've heard the original, let's take a look at the final output of the sound remover tool. Uh, pay attention to the sound of the cell phone that you heard in the original recording. Now that we've heard both the before and the after, let's take a look at how we were able to remove that cell phone ringing from the original audio file. Here's how you do it. Open the file in Adobe Audition and then show the spectral frequency display. Inside of the spectral frequency display, we'll use the paintbrush selection tool to select the frequencies that correspond with the sound that you want to remove from your sound file. Once you've selected the appropriate frequencies that you'd like to remove, Go to the Effects menu, select Noise Reduction and Restoration, and learn Sound Model. The Sound Model represents the patterns of sound and frequencies that should be removed from your overall audio composition. Once Adobe Audition has learned the Sound Model, go to the Effects menu, select Noise Reduction and Restoration, and then select the Sound Remover process. This will open up the Sound Remover dialog where you can configure the settings as appropriate for removing the sound from your overall audio file. If you'd like to learn more, check out my blog at www.tricedesigns.com. Thanks.